Samsung fans, buckle up, because One UI 8 is about to shake things up, and Android 16 is making its grand entrance on Samsung phones this summer. But what does this mean for you and your device? Well, the beta program is just around the corner, and trust me, you won't want to miss the juicy details on when and how you can get in on the action. So when exactly does this new software drop? And which phones are lucky enough to get first dibs? Let's dive in. Hey, welcome back. Sam here. If you love tech scoops like this, smash that like button, share with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more insider updates and cool gadget news. Now, Samsung usually likes to tease us with beta programs a few months before the big stable launch, and this time, everything points to late May or early June 2025 for One UI 8 beta. Why the rush? Android 16, the foundation of this update, is arriving earlier than usual, and with new foldables like the Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 about to hit the shelves, Samsung is clearly prepping for something big. Wondering if your phone will get in on the beta fun? If you're rocking the Galaxy S25 series, the Z Fold 6 or Z Flip 6, you're probably on the shortlist. Some high-end Galaxy A models might sneak in too, but heads up, beta slots fill up fast, so keep your Samsung Members app handy and register ASAP once it's live. Just a quick warning, beta versions can be glitchy. If your phone is your lifeline, you might want to hold off until the official stable release, expected later this summer or early fall. Here's a twist. Samsung isn't just testing the new UI on the latest models. The Galaxy S23 lineup, yes, last year's flagships, are already running early One UI 8 builds based on Android 16 internally. This suggests they might join the beta party too, but probably only in select regions at first. Performance scores for the S23 in these builds are already impressive, with single-core and multi-core benchmarks looking solid, but don't expect final speeds yet, these will only get better. And speaking of fast progress, just last week, a fresh One UI 8 beta build popped up for the Galaxy S25 Ultra, showing Samsung's testing is moving at lightning speed. This rapid update cycle means the public beta isn't far behind. Once it drops, you'll get a chance to test new features before anyone else. Pretty cool, right? Let's talk features, because One UI 8 isn't just a facelift. Samsung is refining tools that debuted on the Galaxy S25 series, especially log video recording and the AI-powered Now Brief. If you're a creator or love crisp video quality, here's a surprise log video recording, which captures way more dynamic range and detail, will finally come to the front camera. That means cinematic selfies and professional vlogging just got a major upgrade. And if you thought that was neat, the Galaxy S25 Edge already supports log on all cameras, hinting Samsung may roll out these perks to other S25 models, even before One UI 8 arrives. Now for the AI fans, the Now Brief feature, your smart daily summary, is getting a read-aloud upgrade. Imagine your personalized weather, calendar and news updates spoken aloud with just a tap, perfect for when you're on the move, or just want to listen instead of read. It's a small tweak with big convenience, and Samsung isn't stopping there. The Z Fold 6, Z Flip 6, and upcoming S24 series will also get these features, showing Samsung wants to spread the love beyond just the newest flagships. Here's the kicker. Google's official Android 16 launch is slated for this summer, and Samsung's beta is likely syncing up perfectly with that timeline. Early reports say One UI 8 feels more like a smooth evolution than a flashy overhaul, which might actually be a smart move. Instead of packing in gimmicks, Samsung is focusing on polishing the experience, making everything work better and smoother. Before I let you go, a quick shout out to some leaked videos showing One UI 8 animations matching the silky smooth transitions of ColorOS 15. For years Chinese brands have nailed fluid animations, and now Samsung is playing catch up, or maybe even aiming to set a new standard. One UI 7 set the stage, but One UI 8 looks ready to raise the bar for user experience. So what's your take? Are you excited to try the beta? Planning to upgrade your device? Drop your thoughts and questions below, I'm always curious what you think. Thanks for hanging out. If this gave you the edge on Samsung's latest, hit like, subscribe, and ring that bell so you never miss out. Until next time, Sam signing off, peace out.